Hi everybody, welcome back to part 3 of the McDonald's food review. I am McMahon Tony. thank you for joining me today. Uh, this is part 3 of the food review. Go back and watch the first two if you haven't seen them. Uh, for, uh, uh, there's no other way to put it, for horrendous experiments, but maybe it could rebound. Because for to celebrate St. Patrick's Day, even though I'm Italian, this is the shamrock cake, and it's already um, it's already melted, but it's still good. So this is the shamrock cake from McDonald's. I've never had a shamrock cake, so let's see what it tastes like. Wow. Mmm. Wow. And one more sip. <gasps> Hallelujah, thank the Lord. Something actually tastes good from McDonald's and there's no blandness to the fla or blandness to the product. Wow. This is exactly what you would expect in a camera cake. Mm. Let's put that down for a second. You got the... I love McDonald's cakes. That's the one thing I would go to McDonald's for, is cakes from McDonald's. Um, you get the awesome vanilla taste. And then, in the back, just when it's percolating in, in your mouth, you got the the mint. And you know what, guys? This is no not a joke. It tastes like a thin mint cookie from uh, from the Girl Scouts. That's, that's how good it is. It could just be this my first time. But it's it's very good. <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm impressed. I didn't think after after the last two experiences I had at McDonald's, I didn't think it'd be this good. But well, so the guy asked me if I wanted a um, a large, medium, or small. I opted to take the small only because the large is 1,100 calories. And there's a challenge video on YouTube um, to buy a shamrock cake and immediately when you get outside, see how fast you can check it. I know Ken Dominic did it, um, someone else did it this week, and uh, I believe Ken Dominic finished it in, I want to guess, 2 minutes and 30 seconds. Uh, if, I'm sorry, Ken, if I'm, if I'm off a bit, but I enjoyed that video. And you know what? The straw was running to my phone. <laughs> I was, I was sucked up the straw. Oh, well, um, let's take one more. This is awesome. I'm sorry as I finish this on camera. Okay, I'm sorry folks, I finished that on camera. A saw is perfect, that's all you need. On my reading seal, I'm going to give the McDonald's camera cake. Wow, 
Um, I'm I'm gonna go. It's gonna have to get an eight out of ten. A vast improvement from my last two McDonald's videos. Um, it tastes like a. It tastes like a uh, liquefied Thin Mint cookie from the Girl Scouts, which I love. I love Thin Mints and they're awesome. And oh my god. And you know what? If you're desperate enough, you can actually use this as either mouthwash or toothpaste. I wouldn't mean, recommend it though because it, it'd be it'd be horrible. It'd be it was horrible if you did it. But if if you're if you're feeling lazy, if you're feeling weary, lazy one day and you don't want to brush your teeth, go get one of these, and your breath will smell like thin for the rest of the day. But that would do it for my review, folks. Um, I want to thank you for joining me on all three uh, McDonald's reviews. Two of them were horrible. One of them was good. And overall, my experience at McDonald's on a scale of 1 to 10, uh, 1 being horrendous, 10 being awesome customer service, I'm going to give uh, the customer service rating a... Ooh, excuse me. <laughs> I'm going to give it possibly a 5 out of 10. Uh, the service wasn't that good. It was, what, what did you expect, you know? I didn't, I didn't pay, I paid, for everything I paid 6 bucks. Oh no, I paid, what did I pay? $7, seven dollars for this, in total. So, you know, you get what you pay for it, but I got, I got horrendous customer service. And when I asked the lady to double bag the Shamrock Shake, because I, I don't have a cup holder on my scooter... Um, she's, I uh, looked at me like I had two heads, so, um, I probably won't be going back there anytime soon, unless the new products are revealed. Mm. But, yeah, a, a horrendous customer service, and I'm definitely gonna possibly send an email to uh, corporate about that because you know you go into McDonald's you expect I'm not gonna say you expect high quality but you know you don't want to look at you like you're you're crazy or you're you're, you're uh, psychotic but that's my food review I want to thank you for watching uh, please like please share please subscribe and then ladies and gentlemen next week or this coming week I should say. I'm doing some te uh, product testing for Taco Bell. Uh, what what am I doing? I'm not sure yet, but I, I just know I'm doing some product testing for Taco Bell this week. So as soon as that's done, I will let you guys know how what what the product is and where you can find them. Um, but look for that video later on this week. Uh, the two videos that you uh, saw both from McDonald's will be released on Saturday. This will be released on Sunday. If you're watching this on Sunday, it's today. If you're watching this on Saturday, it's tomorrow. I know it's confusing, but I don't want to release all three at the same time. Uh, so this gets an eight out of ten. I would strongly recommend you get a small. Don't get a medium or not. Just get a small because it's 1,100 calories and that's way too much for a cake. Once again, folks. Thank you for watching, and for everyone at the Food Lab, this is Nick Mantuna signing off. I hope you have a good day. Thank you.